Hi, I'm Anna Gutierrez and I got to go to Cusco, Peru last summer and I got to work with Zona Segura. It was an incredible experience. Um, as soon as I met everybody there, I fell in love with them. Uh, the way they just radiate Christ's love in a way that you just cannot, it, you can't ignore them and you can ne never forget them. Um, what stood out to me the most was their passion and their hard work. Uh, for their ministry and for people. And um, in Matthew 5, 14 through 16, it says, you are the light of the world. A, situ a city situated on a hill cannot be hidden. No one lights a lamp and puts it under a basket, but rather on a lampstand, and it gives light for all who are in the house. In the same way, let your light shine before men so that they may see your good works and give glory to your Father in heaven. These verses really remind me of the way that they live their lives. Uh, they just shine so brightly in their city of Cusco, Peru. And um, the way they honor God with their lives is just really inspiring. Um, they really love to serve each other and others. And even for us, when we got there, they just kept doing so much for us. And just when I thought, you've done enough, they kept doing more and um, they just did it with so much love and humility and I just made a, an impact on me and I imagine it's making more impact on other people in Cusco. <laughs> okay, so we got to go with them to different uh, universities and different colleges and talking to different kids of different ages. Uh, we did a thing called Tour or More and what they do is they go around and they talk to people about what is true love what does that really mean? And uh, just different things and moral values. It was really neat seeing how they didn't only just teach those things, but they, they lived them out in their everyday lives. And it wasn't just something that they taught about and then forgot, but it was evident in their life. I really also loved hearing them talk about how they're focused on people and not necessarily events, even though the events are good for meeting people and making connections, but their main focus is on people. And they said that even if for some reason they had to leave the entire tour or more or entire event for one person, they would do it because that's what matters and that's what Christ would do. And so uh, all of these just show that their heart, all of these things just show that their heart is in the right place and um, that they really just love unconditionally and selflessly. And um, I would encourage any of you uh, to support them, whether it be through prayer or through finances. They would appreciate it very much. And this is definitely a ministry that you won't regret supporting.